Tesla's secret weapon, how Elon Musk plans to conquer the world with data. Imagine this, you're driving your Tesla, a car that knows exactly how fast you're going, where you're headed, and even when you're likely to break before you do. The moment you turn the key or press the start button, you're not just in control of the vehicle. In fact, the car is learning from you every second, every movement, and every decision. And it's not just your car. It's millions of Teslas across the globe feeding into a colossal web of data. Now, what if I told you that Tesla isn't really a car company? Sure, they build beautiful electric vehicles, but beneath the shiny exterior is something much bigger. Tesla is a data company, and Elon Musk? Well, he might just be building the most powerful data empire the world has ever seen. But wait, how do we get here? How did Tesla, a company that started by revolutionizing the electric car market, transition into this digital overlord, quietly gathering data as if it were oil in the 21st century? Let's rewind. In the early days, Tesla made headlines for its electric vehicles, sleek, fast, and efficient. People thought the company's secret sauce was its lithium ion batteries or its superior electric motors. But over time, something else became clear. Tesla was amassing data on a skill that no other automaker could match. The company's autopilot system, a revolutionary leap towards self-driving cars, wasn't just a neat feature. It was a data gold mine. Each time a Tesla switched into autopilot mode, it sent back streams of information to Tesla servers, helping them fine-tune the AI that would one day take full control. But autopilot is just the beginning. Tesla's entire ecosystem is designed to collect, analyze, and use data. From the moment a Tesla owner starts their car, the vehicle is recording data. How fast you accelerate, where you stop, how long you park, how frequently you change the battery, even the traffic around you is being monitored, processed, and sent back to Tesla HQ. It's like the car is an extension of a vast global nervous system with Elon Musk sitting at the control center. So what's Musk's master plan? To some, it might seem like Musk is merely trying to build the best electric vehicles on the market. But the reality is much more ambitious. Tesla isn't in the business of just selling cars. It's positioning itself at the nexus of transportation, energy, and AI. By collecting enormous amounts of data, Tesla is not just perfecting its own vehicles, but also creating a platform that could redefine industries. Consider this, autonomous driving. Sure, Tesla has been refining its autopilot system for years, but the real end game is full autonomy a fleet of self-driving cars learning from each other in real time and continually improving. Tesla's data isn't just about making cars safer, it's about creating a transportation network where human drivers are no longer necessary. Imagine a future where Tesla's AI-driven vehicles dominate the roads, where city planning and traffic flow are dictated not by human engineers, but by the vast network of data flowing through Tesla's servers. And here's the wild part. It doesn't stop with cars. Tesla's ambitions go far beyond transportation. The company's data empire also extends to energy. Tesla's solar panels and powerwall systems collect data on how energy is consumed, stored, and distributed. Combined with the data from its vehicles, Tesla's positioning itself to become a central player in the global energy market. Musk's vision of a fully sustainable energy ecosystem is it just about reducing emissions? It's about controlling the flow of energy itself, much like how oil barons control the energy market in the last century. But Musk's ambitions don't end there. There's a bigger play, a convergence of data from multiple fronts. Think of it this way. Tesla's data from cars is the tip of the iceberg. Pair that with data from Tesla Energy, which tracks energy usage across homes and cities, and you have an unprecedented window into human behavior on a global scale. Who moves where, who uses energy when, how cities breathe and function. Tesla could, theoretically, know more about the inner workings of a city than the city planners themselves. But here's the twist. What happens when Musk connects the dots between his various ventures? SpaceX, Neuralink, and The Boring Company, each collecting and generating its own streams of data, imagine a world where SpaceX satellites are monitoring the globe in real time, 
Neuralink chips are transmitting brain signals directly to the cloud, and Tesla's vehicles are driving autonomously through cities reshaped by Musk's underground tunnels. All that data, travel patterns, brain signals, energy consumption, flows into a single unified network. Some might call it visionary, others might call it dystopian. But one thing's clear, Tesla's vast data empire is Musk's not-so-secret weapon in his quest for world domination. With enough data, Tesla could influence not just how we drive, but how we live, work, and interact with the world around us. Now let's talk about how Tesla might actually conquer the world. Not through cars, but through data. Tesla's autonomous driving fleet is still in development, but imagine when millions of self-driving Teslas are on the road. They will communicate with each other, optimizing routes, minimizing congestion, and even predicting accidents before they happen. In this world, Tesla wouldn't just be a transportation company, but the operating system for the world's cities. Imagine the power in controlling that data, the ability to influence urban planning, traffic management, even emergency response times. But there's more. Tesla's energy business, its solar roofs, power walls, and energy storage solutions means the company could eventually control large portions of the global energy grid. Tesla's AI would decide when to charge your car, when to use stored energy, and when to pull from the grid. In this scenario, Tesla wouldn't just be a car maker or even an energy provider. It would be a central hub of the world's energy infrastructure, dictating how energy flows through cities, homes, and even countries. And here's the part that might really blow your mind. Tesla's data could extend beyond the physical world. Musk's other adventures, like Neuralink, could create a future where human thought and data are linked. Imagine a future where your Tesla isn't just driving you around, it's syncing with your brain, predicting your needs before you even realize them. Neuralink could be the interface that connects humans to Tesla's AI network, creating a seamless interaction between man and machine. Is this science fiction? Maybe. But consider how much Tesla has already achieved. Ten years ago, the idea of a fully electric car seemed far-fetched. Today, Tesla is the leader in the electric vehicle market. Autonomous driving, a global energy grid, a network of interconnected smart cities. It's all within reach. The real question isn't whether Musk can pull it off, but how much of the world will be under Tesla's control when he does. In the end, Tesla's cars might just be the beginning. With every mile driven, every kilowatt of energy stored, and every decision made by Tesla's AI, the company moves closer to controlling the infrastructure that powers our daily lives. So next time you see a Tesla on the road, remember, it's not just a car. It's a node in a vast data-driven network that could one day control the world. And with Elon Musk at the helm, the future is anything but predictable. If you enjoyed this deep dive into how Tesla is shaping the future with data, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more fascinating stories about tech, innovation, and the people who are transforming our world. Share your thoughts in the comments. What do you think about Tesla's data-driven empire? Is Elon Musk on the way to dominating more than just the electric vehicle market? Let us know what you'd like to see next. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on our upcoming content. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.